Okay. Uh, here's a Tom's Tips media share, and this is from uh, CBS, the uh, broadcast uh, network. And it says, this video that you're about to see was brought to you by the executive producers of The Bag Boy, coming soon on CBS. Chris Fontaine and Pat Fallacy. That show is never going to air because I'm suing the fucking people that have tried to uh, destroy my life and, and make me look like a freaking farce. Perry Caravello is, according to my good friend Sean Hannity, involved in some kind of gay sitcom. I just got off a phone call with Sean. He told me CBS is doing some kind of sitcom about Perry when he was 20 years old and he's going to have sex with a man and go poop in the street in the first episode. Oh, that's a lie. Perry is no longer a friend of ours, folks. If this sitcom is real, and he's signing off on projects like this, he's not who we want around us, and certainly not who I want around my daughter. I was contacted by some nobody named Chris Fontaine who said that he was working on a project involving Perry. I said, Perry's a good friend of me and my family. Of course I want to see. And the pilot episode for the sitcom was disgusting. In the show, it's the 1980s, so Perry's a young guy about 20 years old, and in the first episode alone, he goes number two in the street while skateboarding. He throws a baby down the stairs. He kills somebody with a knife for being straight and liking women. It's disgusting and horrible. In the show, Perry shoots a really attractive woman to death with a pistol until she's barely recognizable, all because he asked him to the movies, and he rushes to the Albertsons grocery store, These and he runs up to this butcher or meat handler guy, and he begins kissing him and rubbing against him, and they even show him suck on the meat man's tongue. Disgusting. My whole family was watching this episode in the TV room thinking it would be something entertaining like PCO, but instead it was a disgusting and very sexual show showing what a perverted and demented creep Perry really was this whole time. I hope this is fake news, Perry. Contact me immediately if this is fake. President Trump, let me explain something to you about this TV show. First off, it, it would never become a TV show because it's, it's so disgusting and demoralizing and this all fucking lies. punk Chris Fontaine. I don't know how he got got away with putting some grossness like this through a TV production company like CBS and uh, allow them to uh, show uh, a TV show or a TV movie uh, in my regards to, to destroy my life. So Chris Fontaine, you you're like being sued. CBS, boy. if it airs, you're being sued. And President Trump, I don't know how in the hell this stuff got back I to have you. No idea and, and Chris Fontaine, got I mean, you and I, you. you and I, and your daughters, uh, actually all your kids, go all the way back to the uh, what was it, the uh, late was it the late nineties or the late ninety two no, when uh, I was at uh, Long Beach Grand Prix, and you were there. That was the year, 91 or 92, <clears throat> when we met at the Long Beach Grand Prix. How you got to watch this it, it is beyond me. And this Chris Fontaine guy, he's got to be stopped. He has got to be stopped. 